is Be A Hero Day here at News 10 NBC. Every year, we team up with 92.5 WBEE to help raise money for the Ronald McDonald House Charities of Rochester. This group does so much, offering a place to stay for families with children going through serious medical treatments here in Rochester. Emily Putnam is live now, kicking off our all-day coverage at the house on Westmoreland Drive. Emily? Good morning, Brennan and Lynette. We are outside the house at Westmoreland Drive, the Ronald McDonald House here in Rochester. Starting right now at 5.30 through 7 p.m. tonight, you will have chances all day to donate to this incredible organization, which is run by President and CEO Joanne Ryan. Joanne, good morning. Good morning, Emily. Thank you so much. So real-life heroes walk through this door behind us every day. Tell me, what does it mean for people in the community to be a hero today? Today is an opportunity to come out and support the work here at the Ronald McDonald House. We have families that come from all parts of the world. We're so fortunate right here in Rochester to have a Ronald McDonald House partnering with your MCN, Rochester Regional Health. The beauty of what we do here is wrap our arms around the family. While their child is receiving care, our job is to really just hold them together and keep them close so they can be at the bedside and help their child to recover. And the organization's slogan is, in fact, keeping families close. What does that mean? You know, it means when your child is critically ill or injured, the challenge of having just the need to be right with them is, is just, it's paramount. And the challenge about managing logistics of lodging and transportation and meals um, is all a distraction. So we work hard to take all those distractions away so families can stay right at the bedside and all of their energy goes into helping their child recover. And if people choose to donate today, how will those donations be used? Help, they help us in so many ways. Uh, right now, during um, still the pandemic, we are able to purchase meals that can actually be in our house so when folks come back from the hospital, they have a nice warm meal waiting for them. There's also opportunities to really just support through uh, the ability to have our rooms refurbished, uh, the chance to have siblings here and have them be well cared for as well. We really want to make sure it's a home experience for a family so that when they are here, they can really feel like they have the strength and energy to get back to that bedside. And as we come out of the pandemic, how did the pandemic affect the house? It did. For a short period of time, we had to close the houses, but we were able to still provide care. We didn't turn one family away. Uh, through relationships with local hotels, we were able to still provide all of the amenities that we did through here, just not on site. And we have everything that you need to know if you want to contribute today. There are a couple different ways you can donate. So get your cell phones out and take these numbers down right now. You can call 585-300-4282. You can text the letters RMHCR to 366 283. That's 366283. Or you can donate any amount anytime online, and you'll find that link on WHEC.com. We'll have live coverage uh, all morning and evening for Be a Hero Day here on News 10 NBC. Phone lines just opened moments ago. It's not too early to give them a call. Your support makes such a difference to these kids and these families.